you issued a report not too long ago that said, I think eight humans uh, had received it and they seem to be okay, is that right? So what we said is that we had the 45 people that went through a phase one were doing okay for safety at the highest dose, a few people at the second dose has a bit of side effect. Uh, but what we said is the first eight of the two lowest dose had neutralizing antibody. This is what you look for. You take the blood from people who get the vaccine and you can look in their blood through scientific techniques to see do we have an antibody that will bind and neutralize the virus so it cannot replicate in your body. If you think about the natural biology, David, when you get infected, you get a few copies of a virus and the virus start to use your own body to replicate. And when you get too much virus, what's called the viral load, you get disease. And so what you want in your body is to educate your immune system. So as soon as the virus will get into your body for a natural infection, your body will be trained through vaccines to make a neutralizing antibody to bind to it so it cannot replicate. Right now, is the vaccine you're developing, is it designed to prevent people from getting the, vac from getting the virus or to mitigate the problems if they do get it? So the number one priority for us is to prevent disease. And in a phase three, what we're going to measure as the primary endpoint of a phase three for efficacy is prevention of disease. Because if you get infection, uh, you get virus in your body, but you get no disease, it's okay. This is the secondary endpoint. So our first objective is no disease. Our secondary objective is no infection. Because as we discussed with the FDA, uh, we will, of course, prefer you have no infection as well. But the number one priority is to make sure you get no disease because, of course, people die from disease, not from infection.